This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Vanessa Villaporte with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. The race for Nebraska governor appears to be down to two. Last night, Jim Pillen declared victory as he became the projected winner of the Republican primary. Charles Herbster finished second and Brett Lindstrom finished third in a tight race. Carol Blood will be his Democratic opponent in the general election. Omaha voters also weighed in on six bond issues, totaling hundreds of millions of dollars. All of them easily passed. Each focuses on areas like street and highway projects, public safety bonds, and parks and rec bonds. Officials say the bonds will not increase taxes. And on 3 News Now, Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz. Record heat for our Wednesday afternoon. Our current record 93, I think we'll do 94. Also with it, high humidity and a little extra wind. Most of us stay dry, but late this afternoon into the evening, a couple isolated storms are expected to fire off. A couple of those could be on the strong side as well. But overnight, we're dry heading into Thursday morning, a low near 72. And then tomorrow afternoon, more heat, more humidity, highs near 95. Again, breaking a record of 93. Thursday night, cold front arrives with it, relief from the heat and humidity into the weekend. But Thursday night, as it arrives, we'll fire off some scattered showers and storms. Some of those could also be strong to severe. Friday, though, a little bit more comfortable, 82, lower humidity. Saturday, low 80s continue. May have to dodge a few spotty showers and storms, though, late Saturday. Sunday, dry and a touch cooler in the upper 70s. That's right back to the low 80s with small rain chances Monday and Tuesday.